Hey artists, let's talk about um, using needles uh, to sew on beads onto your burlap letters. So the plastic needles we've been using are too big for my beads. My beads do not fit over the eye of the needle and you're not going to push it or force it because that will break my needle and that would make me sad. So um, if you want to add beads, there's a little downside. You can't use the bigger needle, which is a little easier to use. If you want to add beads, you're going to have to use a smaller metal needle. They look like this. These are what we call blunt, B-L-U-N-T. Blunt means they are not sharp, where they will hurt you. Um, so these are what we call blunt. Now these can, the um, beads can fit over the eye of the needle, but the thing is that they're a little harder to work with because they're so small. So threading a needle like this, it will take you a really long time and you might be able to get it, but it's a really difficult to put it through the eye of the needle. I do have a little trick. If this is too hard for you, you do not have to put beads onto your burlap uh, letter. Um, this is just a little extra added thing. So what I have right here is a little hot dog bun. It's just, a, I call it a hot dog bun. It's just a little piece of, um, just a little piece of paper that I cut into a rectangle and then I folded it in half. And what you're gonna do is put the yarn, kind of like a hot dog, inside of the bun. And then we can't have any extra showing at the end here, so we have to back it up. Beep, beep, beep. There we go, gone. Okay, now I'm gonna pinch really tight where I just backed that needle up, and I'm gonna slip that through the eye of the needle. So you can see I slipped it through. Let me try that again and show you. So there's the eye, and I'm gonna slip it through. Um, then if I pull, let go of the hot dog bun, voila, we have a threaded needle. Now we're not tying the knot right here. This is not how I've asked you to do it. We're gonna tie it the same way we've always done it with the other pl uh, blue plastic needles, where we even the two ends out. Let me, off camera, I'm gonna have to even these out. And then, let's see, almost even. There we go. So now we're gonna pretend this is one tail instead of two, even though there's two, I'm gonna pretend. We have letter U, letter O, oops, got stuck to me. And then these two tails go under and through letter O, and then we pull. So I grab the two tails, I grab the other end and pull. There we go. Now this is really long, this tail here. Um, after I made the knot, I don't have to have that long of a tail. So there's the knot right there. I can cut it a little shorter. Get that out of the way. All right, this is how we add beads, my friend. So I am going to add a bead um, along my frame. And we're going to start from the bottom. We always start from the bottom because that's where the ugly knot goes. And we're gonna find, I'm trying to make this stitch right here. So we start from the bottom. Okay, that's good. Pull up, 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 up. Oops, check if there's any slack. There is, let me pull on these two. There we go. All right, so now I went up from the bottom and now I can grab a bead. I want, let me think about what color I want. Oh, I think green will look pretty cool. So I just put it into the needle. I pull it all the way through until it goes to the burlap. Okay, and now I can go back in from the top or down from the top is what I say. And pull, 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 pull. So there's a little bit of slack right there, so I'll pull. Aha, and look at that. I have a bead that is sewn on. Let's do that one more time just to make sure that we see how to do it. So you always gotta go from the bottom here, find that next stitch. It's a little low, there we go. Pull up, 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 pull, pull, pull. There's definitely some slack, there we go. And I put my bead on, I think I'll go with a, I think I'll go with a yellow, green and yellow is my pattern. Go onto the needle, push it all the way to the burlap. There we go. 
And now down from the top, or in, down or in from the top. Pull, 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 pull. See that little bit of slack? Gotta go, pull on these, there we go. And that is how we add beads onto our burlap.